Hello art friends, Dr. Beck here. Welcome to Art Ways Where Learning is Fun. Today we're going to be drawing Ribbit the Frog from Animal Crossing and what you're going to need is a piece of paper, pencil, some colored pencils, some pastel if you have, crayons, markers, whatever you have available. See you in a minute. Let's draw the frog Ribbit from Animal Crossing. What I do is I sketch it out lightly ahead of time, do it in Sharpie so you can see, and I tell you always, pause if you need to. Find center, which is gonna be the bottom of Ribbit's head, and Ribbit's head is a big circle. Okay. Now, Let's put in Ribbit's eyes next. One, they're up here. Two. And we're going to make a big circle with another circle in it. A big circle with another circle in it. And going to put these little, this ribbit looks robotic. Looks like somebody built them. It's got this design up here. Good. And now let's do this line next for what's going to appear to look like his mouth. going to come up, over, up, over, and straight across like this. Then we're going to put these one, two, these circles in here circles in here follow that line up follow that line up and stop about there then we're going to come across and down a little across and down a little We're going to follow this line across the top like that. Stop. Do this. And this. And stop. Over. Over. Stop. Up. Up. Stop. Over. And then we're going to follow these lines like this. Boom. Circle, circle. Circle, circle. And then let's put a few along here. One more. And then he has some kind of a design in here and here and here. I think we can only see a little. There's Ribbit's head. Body is easy. Line down, line down. That was the hardest part of the drawing. S slight curve. Design, his body goes like that. Like that. Almost looks like a bolt. Ribbit's arms, easy. 
Moin. Moin. Loop. Circle, 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 circle. Again, if I move too quickly, just pause the video. Loop. Look at these. For the legs, ready? One, two, three, four. We're going to stop halfway and put these in right here. So that they extend outside the leg a little. Bottom of his leg. Circle, 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 circle. And then that is it for the drawing. Again, if you had a pause, no big deal. What I'm gonna do um, to color and rivet, because he's so metallic on his head, is I'm gonna use some pastel. I'm gonna use, um, I don't have a gray pastel, I have black. So what I'm gonna do is use a paper towel, I'm gonna dip it in, and I'm gonna work with scrap paper here. And I'm going to get some of the excess heavy black off, and just so it gets light like this, watch this and then I'll apply it in here. And what I'm gonna do is this, I'm gonna take this black out, lay it here, and always work here first, this way I get the excess out, and then I put it on there. But what I'm gonna do very first, I'm gonna erase all my lines. Like I said, I sketch it out first, so that I could draw for you in Sharpie. Okay, and I'm gonna do the pastel first. Pastel erases pretty easy in case you really mess up. And I'm going to, again, get the excess. And because these lines here are going to be in black, I'm not gonna to be too careful in there. I'm gonna be coloring that in, so I'll be careful near that one. All the dots are black, so I'm gonna be careful a little. visiting art ways today because there are so many ways to use art. I hope everybody enjoyed drawing rivet today and don't forget be smart include art. See you next time.